Welcome to Tech Brothers with Amiru. In this video, we are going to learn how to connect from Tableau to GCP BigQuery by using a service account. So uh, that's uh, often we need to run uh, our reports uh, and uh, we are using a uh, BigQuery as data source. So that's uh, possible and uh, Tableau is a very uh, neat uh, software where we can run tons of uh, different type of uh, reporting. Uh, and we would, what we would like to do, we would like to use a service account. Um, so for that, uh, uh, I have to do some setup here. So first of all, I'm going to go ahead and create the service account. Um, and then uh, I will show you, uh, I have a BigQuery there already created data set and table that I will show you that and we will access that and the second part uh, um, I'm not going to install Tableau here because I have already installed it's just a download and click click next uh, so there isn't really anything to do uh, and uh, you will just open and uh, work on it now let's go ahead and first of all uh, we'll create a service account um, here I'm in console.cloud.google.com here uh, we'll click on uh, this navigation menu and then uh, go to IAM and admin uh, you will go to service accounts here and uh, then uh, we'll will be creating a service account uh, create service account tab is right there and uh, let's go ahead and create uh, our service account uh, I'm gonna call this one uh, BQ uh, BigQuery reporting and uh, that should uh, report uh, SVC okay BigQuery uh, that's a service account uh, the name we have un uniquely given now uh, now uh, if you want to give some description that's fine if you don't want to give it it's okay as well and create and continue so now we are fine here and here we will be providing some permissions uh, so I'm gonna go ahead and uh, type a big query and uh, it is gonna give me a big query admin editor owner and all that um, I'm only interested in a big query data viewer uh, because I'm going to just view the data and uh, hit uh, continue and uh, now service account access to report checked uh, uh, that shouldn't be a problem continue again uh, not sure why it gave me the error first time no, uh, that shouldn't be the issue. But anyways, I just click next and it worked. Now, uh, if we want to grant some um, user access to this service account, you can do it. We already have a given uh, permission on this uh, project, you know, to the uh, BigQuery. So uh, BigQuery is part of that, you know. So that's fine. So we can hit uh, uh, done. And uh, this uh, service account has a permission. Uh, uh, on the BigQuery uh, uh, data set so okay so here you can see that uh, that's our account I'm gonna go right here on the actions uh, you can uh, click manage keys here or simply click here and it will take you there now you go to the keys here and uh, here we are going to add the key and create new key and I will select JSON it's gonna create a, a JSON a key for us and download them so that's what we will use in the tableau and click uh, close and we are all good uh, you can see right there is a key created and it is uh, uh, not expiring on any date because I didn't give any expiration date um, so that's all good for now and uh, let me take you to the uh, BigQuery so click on uh, this uh, navigation menu again go to the BigQuery and uh, here is our BigQuery and uh, I will show you uh, my uh, project is here and uh, then uh, I have uh, this uh, data set um, so Ahmed DB is uh, there and uh, then I have a single table called the test um, I can simply click right there and say open and uh, then we are gonna see some data here uh, so you can preview and uh, there are two records one Ahmed to uh, Raza and that's all this table has um, so very easy if you need to create this all from a uh, scratch that's not a big deal you will simply click right there and uh, you will create a table here and just provide some uh, um, columns and data types and it will create a tab table for you there are tons of video you can watch how to create table and how to create uh, the data set uh, okay now we are all set here the next part is uh, I went to the Tableau um, when I don't need to download I logged in uh, I actually created my account and uh, then I was able to download the desktop version of it uh, let's uh, uh, let me search for it uh, and if you, I search right here Tableau 2022.3 uh, 20, uh, that's the app it uh, have installed so it's a desktop version that I installed click right there and uh, now we open it okay so you can see it right there Tableau trial is uh, 14 days I've been using yesterday so it's uh, one day is gone continue trial 
and uh, it's, it has opened on Tableau here. Now, also, I'm not Tableau expert, so it is a. Uh, it was little like um, I'm honestly, it wasn't really it wasn't hard for me to understand uh, because I have some background with SSRS. So, so anyways, uh, I went here to the server and I saw that uh, like web connector, other ODBC, JDBC connectors, and here I clicked on more. And uh, you can see right there, there is a big query, but I first click on more. And then uh, I saw all these uh, connectors uh, that I can use uh, to connect uh, to different uh, data sources. Um, I, I uh, searched for big query here, and uh, there was two things uh, uh, with the big uh, Google BigQuery and IBM Big Insight. Um, as I need to use BigQuery, I clicked on uh, Google BigQuery. So once I clicked a big query, it asked me authentication uh, and it gave me a couple of options here. Sign in with, you know, OAuth or sign in using a service account. Uh, in my case, I clicked a service account. So once I click service account, it is uh, asking me, hey, where is your JSON file? Remember that we create the key file for our service account. Um, and uh, that is in our uh, download right here and uh, that we will be able to use it. Uh, now, if I go back here and uh, let's, let me take you guys here. Uh, on the sorry Tableau and uh, I will browse and uh, then I will go to the download folder right here and that's the file we just uh, downloaded um, so I'm gonna select that file and uh, then I'm gonna hit uh, open the new file is selected and sign in okay so finally we are here and uh, you can see that uh, connections BigQuery right there and uh, then it is a building project so you can uh, select the building project here and uh, then you have project you can select the project there are a couple of projects here I have uh, the one I'm gonna use is called the Tech Brothers IT project once I select that, it's going to give me the option to data set. Um, and uh, there's only one data set, uh, if you remember that I showed you in the BigQuery. So, and uh, there is only one table test, uh, and that's what we have right there. And uh, this test, uh, th this has only uh, just the uh, two records. Um, so let me take you back here. Uh, if I will show you in the BigQuery, ArmorDB, that's our data set, and this is our uh, table um, straightforward not a big deal so now we go to the tableau and see right there this was our project in google and uh, this was our data set and this is a table if i would have more data sets it will show me more data sets so i don't have it and uh, you can always uh, click right here and select the data set um, now um, i'm going to drag this test table right here and then work with it okay so my table is here and you can see right there i have id and uh, uh, then uh, I have a name so there are two fields uh, I have it here and uh, this is our uh, table right here uh, you know and telling you this is coming from this data set uh, and uh, now I am going to see if I can uh, create some report so here is called the go to sheet one okay so this is data source uh, right now so I figure out like this is the sheet one and if I click on sheet one uh, then uh, those uh, columns come here under the table um, so our test table is there and uh, these are the columns uh, so this is sheet one um, so let's uh, put in columns and rows uh, so if i will just uh, take this uh, id here and uh, service has denied access to this request user does not have a big very job create permission okay so one more permission we need to give is a job creator so that's uh, the problem that's good thing at least we know that this is an extra permission we need so what we will do we'll go back to our service account here so here we need to provide the job role uh, um, to the uh, our service account so you're gonna come here in the navigation menu and then gonna go to the IAM and admin uh, click right there and uh, you are gonna see all those uh, uh, your uh, accounts here you're gonna see all the principles here and here is our uh, BQ service account right there okay and click right there edit principle and then we will provide some role to it um, and uh, as of now you can see that the big query data viewer is assigned and I'm gonna get another role so in this time uh, I'm going to add the role called the big query job run big query and uh, I'm gonna scroll down and uh, here the BigQuery job user sorry not run job uh, user that I need to provide here I click right there and save and uh, that should do it and now I will go back to Tableau and uh, I'm going to close this and uh, then uh, I'm going to bring the other column uh, called the name 
So this time it did not give me error and you can see that the, I am able to see the data just fine. Uh, so now this is how you will, uh, uh, you know, you use service account uh, uh, in a tableau from, and to access the data from the BigQuery. So two roles has to be provided a BigQuery viewer and BigQuery job run. Those has to be provided and uh, then uh, also you will download that uh, key file and uh, then use that uh, in the service account when you log in uh, by uh, in the tableau it always asks you hey provide me that JSON file that you downloaded uh, for your service account and after that you're all good. So I, I wish I would know more uh, about my uh, Tableau here so I could uh, show you the report and all that but uh, you know that's one of the things I'm not really expert uh, in uh, Tableau so at least uh, I can show you the data is coming right from our uh, BigQuery so you can see the ID and uh, you can see the name you can play with it a little bit uh, and uh, this is much better you know you can bring it here and uh, you can see that uh, ID and, uh, and then uh, you have names here and whatever you want to play with it okay thank you very much for watching i hope this video is uh, helpful for you uh, to connect uh, to the BigQuery from the tableau by using service account thanks and uh, please subscribe my channel and i will see you guys in the next video